here I'm took off the wrapper already. This is called Cherry Blossom. I have one more of bath bomb I got from Walmart. I believe my mom ordered some from another store or Amazon. I can't remember. So I want to use them up before I use the mother. And I can make some homemade ones, so just let you know. So this is cherry blossom. Let's see what it looks like. And it smells really good. It's kind of strong, so it's pink. The whole thing is pink. Now, if you go to um, Justice, their bath bombs are always unique and sparkly. So, I have the water running, just like it says to keep it good. All right, once these, this one and the next one that I'm gonna do will be done, then I will use some other bath bombs that my mom ordered, or I will make some. So starting off really good. Okay. See how it's bubbling? That's a good thing. Now I don't know, because the last one I did, it dissolved kind of fast. I thought it wouldn't, but so I'm not sure about this one, how it's gonna dissolve, but they all so far they make my skin soft. Still in it. So I think I give this an, an okay, still some, it's a sideways thumbs because of this, of the color was beautiful, but I don't know how long it's gonna last and the smells there. So that's good. Now if you guys are wondering why I put shower bombs in my name is because I did put a video how to do a shower bomb in my bathtub shower. I will show you how to do one with that has a door. My parents' bathroom. And I will show you in a different kind of bathroom if you would. Um, and I put cute because a lot of time bathtubs, not bathtubs, sorry, a lot of times um, bath bombs are, to me, my opinion, are really cute. So as you can tell, I just give it a C now because, or thumbs down because it's not, the, the only thing is there is the smell, like there's no, it was just right when I, a little fizzled, so yeah not very good still from Walmart we have one more from Walmart so just let everyone know then I will make homemade or I will do the one my mom ordered so just let you know